Welcome back guys, it's Aaron from Life's a Glitch. Today I'm going to be showing you how to receive and put the nightclub set into its correct positions. For this you're going to need to get yourself glitched out. So I'll put a link in the description down below. You're going to need to make yourself to that location. And you're also going to need to have a friend with a modded nightclub set that you want to receive. So in my case, I've got this lovely one out on street wheels, Benny's, all the green tint, you know, all that good stuff. I've called my MOC out. Once you have called your MOC out and you've called out your free car, you're going to want to make sure you have got free cars stored in any basement level of your nightclub. So in my case, I'm using basement level two. So what Keith's going to do now, seeing as he's the one giving it to me, he's going to be pressing down on the D-pad and he's going to get the story mode alert. So he's going to press up on the right analog stick to Franklin. So he's sitting on that black screen alert. I'll press right on the D-pad and I'll be hit with that alert. Just press X. What this will do, Keith will get kicked out of the vehicle. I'll now reverse back, press triangle, run up to the back of my MOC. Now I'll get close to this blue circle. When I'm near this blue circle, I'm going to get the story mode alert up. This is a lot quicker, so I'm going to press down on the D-pad and press up on the right analog stick. And then on this alert, I'm going to press circle. Now we'll walk in, enter alone, and I'm going to do that again. So I'm going to press down on the D-pad and up on the right analog stick. It can take about 10 seconds roughly to pop up, but it will pop up. Then just press circle. There you go. I'm invisible. That's to save you from bouncing on someone in a different target mode and going through all the communities and that. So then just press triangle once you're invisible. There we go. I've just received that vehicle so it's just literally rinse and repeat from here go outside and now request a free vehicle from your um, nightclub so it needs to be basement two three or four I think it is wherever you've got your free vehicles there we go my free vehicles are there request one of them As you can see, I've used the uh, elevator method, so I haven't got my mini-map at the bottom left. Get into my free vehicle and rinse and repeat the process. So what I'm doing, I will be now pushing that modded speedo over to the basement, because that's where I've just called this car from. It is important you do this, guys. Press right on the D-pad, personal full. So, yep, press X. What that has done is it's now pushed that vehicle. Again, reverse this back. Not keep over in the process. And again, run up to the circle. Down on the D-pad. Press forward on the right analog stick. Press circle on that alert. Enter alone. And then do the same again. Down on the D-pad. Forward on the right analog stick and then decline the story mode alert sometime today there we go, circle, I'm invisible run, jump into the vehicle there we go, as you can see it's glitching out but I've managed to get out of that So again, I'm going to call a vehicle from basement level 2, we'll keep them all in the same level just because it makes it easier. As you can see, my speedo is not there, it does not show on that, it's not a problem, don't panic, I did when I first done it, it's just the normal now to be fair. So. Just get another free car out. I wish the mechanic dropped it right to you. You don't nowadays. But there we go. Keith just pulled that one out for me. Lovely set there. Get into my free vehicle. Alongside Keith, that's it mate. 
drive to the back of my MOC. Press right on the D-pad. Chief's obviously sitting on the story mode alert. And I'll just decline that. Or accept that rather. Reverse back, get out. Run towards the blue circle whilst Keith's standing at the back. Press down on the D-pad and then forward on the right analog stick and decline that. Just do it again just to make sure. Enter alone. Down on the D-pad. Right stick forward and then press circle on the alert that comes up. Then hop in the vehicle. There we go, it's glitching out, and as you can see, it put me into the void. Now, if it does this, all you want to do is you want to get your friend who's given you the vehicle to register as a MC president or a CEO and invite you to their organization or their clubhouse. Then what this will do, it will pull you out. Just got to wait for an invitation from Keith. Come on, Keith. There we go. Accept. And this will pull me out of my mobile operation center in that void. There we go. Now again, call out a free car from the same level. because I want to receive the terabyte. As you can see, my mobile operation center disappeared so I'm gonna to have to request that and put it in another location or put it in the same location that that's normal that will happen when you get stuck in a void so if I face this way and request my mobile operation center it should should spawn behind me there we go my cars over there Nightmare, I'll run and get that. So my mobile operation centre is round the corner. Keith's brought out that lovely terabyte. So again, to receive it, get a free car out, drive to the back of the mobile operation centre. Keith will be on the story mode alert. Accept that. Keith will get out. I'll press triangle to get out. Run to the back of my mobile operation centre near the blue circle. Press down on the D-pad and forward on the right analog stick. Bring up the story mode alert. Decline that. I'll walk in. Press enter alone. Then down on the analog, uh, down on the D-pad and forward on the right analog stick. And then decline that alert. I'm invisible run and get into the terabyte there we go it'll glitch out as you can see it pushed me through and I'm falling through to the map now what you want to do you want to close your application so but beforehand I'd force a save change your style or whatever but close your application and then simply restart your application up again Get your friend to send you an invite to their session. As you can see, I was waiting for Keith to send me one. But he did send me one in the end. Oh, hopefully, when the PS5 or the Xbox comes out, these loading times will be a lot quicker. There we go. So I'm um, now down at the map, bottom of the map, by the docks. Now I'm going to get onto my presser and I'm going to fly it over to my nightclub. Once you're here, what you want to do, you want to go to your 
interaction menu, you want to go to your mobile operation center in services and request personal vehicle. This should bring you your terabyte that you just received. There we go, so I'm going to run over, go get that. Then from here, you're going to want to drive it into um, basement level 2 along with your other nightclub set. Now what you want to do is drive to the blue circle and you want to enter your nightclub. And then you want to go to basement level 2 where you've got your free car stored. Then press X on that alert. Then what this will do, it will swap out the vehicle that you pick on the list once you get in there. Select the vehicle. There we go. That will push that vehicle to the back of your mobile operation centre. Now, to get these to save and to put them into the right slots, what you're going to want to do, you want to get into the vehicle. Get in, press right on the D-pad. Then all you want to do is change something on it. So, no armor, there we go. Then, it's it vehicle. Do the same to all of them. So get in. Right on the D-pad. Change something. As you can see, I didn't do that. I didn't notice that at the time. Get into the next vehicle, right on the D-pad, change something. Armour, no armour. Exit vehicle. Oh, I think that's had a bit too much to drink, that one. Get into the terabyte. Right on the D-pad. Change something and change it back. Exit vehicle. Now, what this should have done is altered all of my standard ones down on their correct slots. So I'll go to basement level one. I will check the terabyte first. There we go, as you can see, my terabyte is in the correct location. That was completely standard. Now I'll go to basement level one and just make sure that they have all transferred over. So there's three in here. There we go, as you can see, I messed up. I didn't do the medium one. That's why you check before you get rid of the vehicles. So go to basement level two where they're stored. We know all the other ones are saved because they've transferred over. But me being a bit of a drip, I forgot and didn't do it properly. So get into your vehicle and just change one thing on that. Right on the D-pad, arm up, buy, then get rid of it, exit vehicle. Now I'm just going to check again because I thought I was losing it. So I'll go in there, basement level 1, just to make sure. It's better to be safe than sorry, otherwise you could lose it. You could trade with someone or you could lose the modded set and you'll be pissed. There we go, as you can see. They're all in their correct location. Now, what you can do is you can buy over in buy over the modded ones in your basement level two. So I'm just gonna buy these because they're free for me. There we go. Go down. Nightclub garage two. Then buy over them. It's as easy as that guys. Any problems leave them down in the comments down below. Smash like, subscribe, all that good stuff. And I'll catch you on the next one.